guys, welcome back to Spy Kai. I'm Kai, and today we are back once again. I don't have an intro for you today because my stomach hurts because I'm really, really hungry. But I decided that you guys are more important than eating. So I'm going to go ahead and make this tutorial before I have my morning breakfast today. It is Wednesday. I'm recording this the day of Wednesday right now. So I want to go ahead and make some pixel art for you guys once again because you guys seem to love it i love pixel art we need to do more on the channel and i am actually working on a pixel art project right now so i decided maybe this would be something fun that we can do um while i'm working on that so let's go ahead and get started you're probably gonna see me make a couple of really random things in the channel pixel art wise that i'm gonna be using for the project most likely so let's go ahead and get started i'd like the first kind of episode i guess and i want to go ahead and make a chest so i don't really know how i want this style to be the first thing we need to do is we need to get down some basic lines first so let's go ahead and just do something like like this for now maybe and then we'll just change all of the colors as we go um i think that's too skinny actually uh we're just gonna do something like this and maybe have this come down and then like this is that too skinny no it looks fine that's it's that's, that's good that's that's doable that's doable and then we'll come down like this all the way and then maybe we'll have like a little little latch right here and this piece will be maybe raised up a little bit like like that that's oh, too skinny all right we're just what i'm doing is i'm just basically getting down the base um the base like shape as it were first so we can worry about all the colors and stuff a little later on um so um we're kind of just kind of just trying to get it down first and then we will worry about what everything looks like in a moment i want to maybe maybe raise this uh, maybe we'll flip it so it's like on the bottom like this little lock maybe do i want to do like Ooh, yeah, okay, 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 we'll do like this. That's perfect. Now we just need to kind of get down the other base colors here. So we'll do like a brownish color. Um, something like this, I guess. Maybe a little darker than that. Uh, all right. That song has been stuck in my head that... In the middle of the night. That song has been stuck in my head, guys. Anybody else have that song stuck in their head right now? I don't know. It is in my head right now. And I don't appreciate it. All right, we're going to do something like this, like the lines of the wood, and then we need like a silverish color. Add a little bit of blue to the silver, though, make it look a little better, you know, and then we will go ahead and make these like, oh, make these like this. Do I want to do this too? Oh, maybe. Oh, I kind of like that. Wait, that's kind of good. Okay, wait, and then we will do like, maybe we need like a top piece. So let's go ahead and make this a little brighter. Um, well, I drop the hit I to eye drop the uh, chest color and we'll just raise it up like this a little bit and then maybe not that much this will all be the top of the chest like that that's good wait maybe one more down and then we'll use this color as this color oh that looks so good cool 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 I love this art style I love this a lot actually all right and then we'll do the same thing with um, this color right here we'll brighten this up a little bit Maybe we'll pull it up by one. Yes, that looks so cool. What, is, what if I do like this? Now nah, it looks strange. All right, there we go. Cool. Now it looks like it's a little, little higher up, um, which is what I want. So let's go ahead and do that. Maybe I might actually drop this color down a little bit, make it a little darker like uh, like that. Yeah. And then we'll just raise it back up for that piece. Or maybe. Hmm. Maybe that color? Oh, I, I like that. Wait, wait, I like that. I like that. A little less saturated, though. There we go. Okay. And then we'll put this down there and down there. And we'll do that. It looks so good. A little less saturated, maybe still. It's still kind of bright. Or still kind of bluish. Too bluish. Okay. I think it looks really cool. It looks really good. I like that a lot. Um, Now, I... I think we might need a brighter spot there too no yes maybe so potentially yeah, and then maybe we'll raise these two up right here so hit m to drag a little box over top of that hold on shift drag a box over top of that and then just pull these up 
hit select, deselect, hit eye to eye drop, the darker color, and then just pull that like that. There we go. Okay, it looks really cool. I like this a lot. This is really, really cool. Uh, really cool. Then we'll just use this color right here and put it there so it looks like the lines are still going down. Um, all right. And then maybe this piece should be silver too, or maybe this piece should be like gold or something. This is where the key goes. There's like a golder color here. Oh yeah, it looks really special. It's a little, a little, a little bright though. But like this, I think. Uh, I don't like that at all, actually. And then we'll drag it down. A little more to the orange. A little more saturation. A little less saturation. Um, I can't tell if I like this. I can't tell if I like that or not. I can't lie to you. I can't lie to you. We'll leave it for now. We'll leave it. We'll leave it. We'll leave it. Maybe we'll do something like um, like that. Wait, I drop that, put it there, and then we'll just make this really bright and do put it like there. I'm trying to see what it looks like from far away, you know, because it's gonna be further away because it's pixel art. Um, I just don't like that. We're gonna do something else here. Maybe we'll do a darker color. Okay, that looks a little better, maybe. Potentially. I like that. That's decent. That's decent. That's decent. I, can, I can deal with that. I can work with that. I can deal with that. I can work with that. Um, now I think I might just go all the way across, actually. Like, like that. And then we'll maybe get rid of these pieces. Do I want to do that? Oh, wait. This is not the same color anymore. Alright. Oh! Oh, that looks sweet! Wait. Okay. Maybe do I want to... Do we raise it up now by one? No, I don't think we do. I think it's because it's even. We have two here and two here. Um, this is my process, basically, ladies and gentlemen. Um, okay. All right. This looks really good. Maybe we raise the whole thing up by one, like this. I think we do. Okay, that's perfect. I just hit B to grab the box tool to do that, by the way, if you were wondering. All right. Okay. And then we raise this up as well, I believe. There we go. All right. Perfect. In the middle of it. Okay, I'll stop. Um, all right. We need, I believe. I think we. I think this is done. Potentially, I want to maybe raise this up. Um, more now because this area is not big enough for my liking. This chest is kind of tall now, and I don't know if I really like that. But we will just have to see. I might squash this back down actually because it is pretty tall. It's almost taking up the whole... Mm, I mean, I think that's fine. I think that's okay. Uh, we'll, we'll see, we'll see, we'll see. We'll, we'll see how it goes. Um, all right, cool. Now, I think the last thing we need to do is we need to go ahead and make it so that everything is um, not as harsh uh, in the with the with the black lines like this because I don't think I really like the way that it's looking. Um, so let's go ahead and just grab the darkest color of gray that we have. Um, and then we will just drag the colors way down like that. Maybe add a little bit of purple. Oh, okay, well that works. We can do that too. I just accidentally um, the fill tooled everything. But yeah, there we go. So that looks really good. And then for the uh, the brown parts, we'll grab the darkest brown color that we have, which is this. And then we'll drag the color way down, add a little bit more red to it. And then we will go ahead and paint with it. There we go. I really like the way this look. Oh, I really like the way this looks. Actually, that's not what I want to do there um this is actually all supposed to be that same color um what do we do there maybe just like that maybe yeah maybe potentially i think this gray might be a little too dark so let's go ahead and just drop that color back down like this Add a little bit of blue in there. Does it look better? I think it might be too light now. There we go. Okay. I think it looks pretty good. I think it looks fine. It looks great, actually. I do want to add maybe some purple instead of... Yeah, the purple makes it look really, really cool. Um, hmm. I can't tell if I want these two lines there or not. I, I do. I want those there. I like those. I want the bottom ones, too. I don't know if I want... I like the square edges or I like the rounded ones. Um, unfortunately, but I guess we'll leave it like this. It looks really good. 
Um, I really do enjoy this, actually. It looks really cool. Um, I don't think there's anything else I should do to this, actually, uh, other than maybe like a darker... Let's go ahead and, um, let's go ahead and make a shadow for this, for underneath this right now. Because it is looking kind of flat under here. So we'll grab a darker color and put it just under that line there. Same thing with this color. Drag it down slightly, just slightly, nothing crazy. And then for this, with the same thing, drag this color down. There, there. Yeah, there we go. That's very, very subtle, but it looks really, really cool. It's super subtle. Extremely subtle. I might even get rid of it just to keep the color palette smaller. But I mean, it does look good. We'll leave it. That's fine. Um, okay, cool. Looks very, very, very cool. I do enjoy this quite a bit. Um, maybe... Maybe something like that maybe just leaving it the same color yeah i want to keep the color palette as small as is possible um so getting rid of that extra color and just having it bleed into this color looks really kind of cool um and then maybe we'll do like this for the ed top edges up there and maybe this for the bottom ones eh, we can't we can leave that i guess eh. well, well i'm okay this is when this is when i force myself to stop because we're doing too much ladies and gentlemen i hope you enjoyed it i'm gonna do the same thing with this up here actually i'm gonna i drop this color and then fill this color there we go so we have basically like maybe five colors now that we're working with um especially if i get rid of these um then we are only working with a very small amount of colors which is exactly what i want i don't want to work with a lot of colors i really just want to have the smallest palette as is possible um this is kind of strange down here now so maybe we might need those two but other than that i think we're chilling like I said, ladies and gentlemen, I hope you enjoyed today's tutorial. This is a little chest and a little RPG kind of chest, I suppose. Um, but yeah, I will see you in the next one. But until then, bye-bye.